All right, one final bit of extra learning this week, maybe extra learning. Uh, you remember the firewall was on and the ping wasn't working, and I said, oh, just turn it off. That's kind of lame. So we're going to turn the firewall back on. And then we're going to talk about what we can do to actually fix the problem instead of just ignoring it. Uh, in the lab, it doesn't matter what you ignore it. But in the real world, you might want to actually make it work the right way. So we look now, the ping stopped working. So what we can do is we can go to advanced settings. Um, we want to have an inbound rule. I actually <clears throat> looked through here to see if I saw anything that looked like ping or echo requests so I could turn it on um, in the existing rules. But I didn't really see anything. So what, what we can do is we can add a new rule. Um, just hit next. You know, we're going to let any program use this rule. We are going to allow the connection. Um, which of these rules do we want it to apply to our pi private network, our public network, or our domain? I'm going to leave them all checked for now. Um, I'm going to call the rule ICMP. Um, and then hit finish. And if we look at the uh, traffic, now the ping's being allowed. So uh, let's actually look at that rule because I did not see where we actually set the thing I wanted to set. Yeah. So yeah, so that, I skipped a step somewhere. We actually wanted to pick ICMPv4 as the type. So I'm going to go ahead and hit OK. Um, that basically, what I did the first time through, did a rule that let everything through. So let's go ahead and do this again and see where I missed that step. So we want to, why did I hit that twice? We want to, uh, oh, custom rule. So yeah, I missed the very first step. All programs, protocol type ICMP4, right? And then we could customize that. If we only wanted to let uh, echo request in, we could say, just let echo request in. Um, and then hit OK. And then continue through that. So basically, I went wrong on my first step of that thing. But then I fixed it by editing the rule. So hey, we got extra learning on how to edit a rule. So now, um, if we look, we are letting ICMP through. So perfect. That's some extra learning. See, it's working.